Hammett first burst into the scene when she competed in the Mae Young Classic, in a losing effort to Abby Leith in the first round. The 6 foot 1 German powerhouse would later sign with NXT UK as Ginny's enforcer. However, after being told by WWE writers that they had nothing planned for her on Raw or SmackDown, Gavitt chose not to renew her contract and subsequently left. Nicole Bass was best remembered for being Sable's bodyguard. She made her debut at WrestleMania 15, helping Sable retain her women's championship. The former bodybuilder stood at a mighty 6 foot 2 inches and weighed 240 pounds. She was briefly involved in a feud with Deborah, as well as having a weird love interest with Val Venus. I want your sly trombone. Oh! Yikes! But her time in the WWE was cut short after she left, filing a lawsuit against the WWE for sexual harassment. Raylan Devine is a name you might not have heard of, but that may change very soon. She is the sister of WWE superstar Mace, and is one of many NXT recruits looking to make it big in the WWE. And I say big quite literally. She stands at an impressive 6 foot 3 inches tall, which makes her the third tallest woman to sign with the WWE. And when she makes her NXT debut, she will be the tallest active female wrestler today. Known for her signature green mohawk, Mad Maxine stood out from the crowd looks-wise and height-wise. She was managed by the fabulous Moolah and stood at 6 foot 4 inches tall, making her the tallest ever female to wrestle in the WWE. Although her run was short and uneventful, the WWE had big plans for her, and she was originally animated to appear in the CBS Hulk Hogan cartoon, but she left the company before that transpired. Aloisa could have been a name remembered in the history books, just based on her size alone. She originally stood at a colossal 6 foot 9 inches, before losing 3 quarters of an inch because of a slipped disc. Aloisa signed a developmental deal with the WWE, and was scheduled to appear on Season 3 of NXT, but was released before this could happen. She was replaced by Caitlyn, who funnily enough went on to win. It is widely believed that she was fired for lying on her talent information form about having erotic images online. I can think of one person who can relate to her. Uh, Mitch, this is your first time getting a blowjob from a guy, huh? It is, yeah. <laughs>